Chicago. They're playing the the Aviators today. I'm joined here with Eli Atwood. Hello. Okay, so might not be the best angle all the time. This so, is poor connection. It is? Okay. Yeah, like, like, yeah. Um. I want to thank the subscribers I got last night. We have now reached, I think as of this morning, yeah, is last time I checked, we had thir 13 subscribers. So, here's Saquon Barkley and Devontae Freeman. Is you it got 15 right now. 15 subscribers. Hey everybody, it's the coach. Okay. So on EA Sports. So let's see. I have my colleague through FaceTime right now viewing the game. You have a good view, Eli. I'll be back at halftime to look at some of these okay. scores from Sunday's action. But for now, it's Monday night football. And it's not really Monday night football. And Charles All right, thanks, coach. EA Looks like I saw an ambulance in the back. Alright, so they're coming out of the tunnel. So this is the second team to Chicago. So those are the standings. Some of them are not official. Like the Wizards are in second. They come in losers at two so, straight, so they're trying to right the ship here. Let's little. see if they can win. Jeterian Melvin is really the returner. This game, so they the okay. Playing well and stopping this streak. So how do you think how do you think the the blues can end their streak? Maybe. Alright, so last time these two teams met, Columbus got their first win, and now we are underway from Chicago. As this return going to the 20, and he'll be brought down to the 28 yard line. So, I'll give you the analysis on this guy, Big Ben Roethlisberger. What do you think he has to do in this game? Um, he has to come through for the team. He really has to. They are not in numbers. They all got placed on the Saturday slate, which is the worst games. If you if you want to be a good have a good game on your schedule, then it, it's going to be on Friday or Sunday. As it's a handoff to his running back to who is that? And I'll show you the Columbus offense. What do you think of them? Pretty good. Look, DeAndre Hopkins number 10 for Columbus. That, he, he could look good in this game if he makes an impact. Let's see the game involved. As it's second and five, Hopkins is in motion. Roethlisberger dumping it off. He'll go down to 37 just short of the first down. Looks like we're going to show the Chicago defense. What do you think of them and what they have to do? Oh, they have Khalil Mack. Right, go on, go on. They got, uh, Chicago defense, they need to have a strong coverage of the Xavier's. Yeah. So Sims with the reception, third down and one for Chicago. Here's the snap, handing it off, and he'll get stopped. Saquon Barkley, that's the running back. Oh, I apologize for the shaky camera angle, Eli. And so let's see, third and short. What do you think of this run right here? Yeah. As Brad Wing will point it away. And that's going to go back to the end zone for a touchback. And now we'll see starting quarterback for Chicago, number 12, Andrew Luck. What, what do you think he has to do to end their two game losing streak? 
pretty. I mean, he has come through for the team to make some passes. No touchdown passes. There's no way we'll see what they have on offense. I know they have. I think I know they have Ty Hilton. So they brought b uh, back a connection from Indianapolis. First and ten, gonna hand it off to that's Freeman with the handoff. It'll go down. And here is the Chicago offense. What do you think of them? Back some receivers. Hunter Henry, that's good. Second and seven. Second and seven for the the Blues. Snap going to hand it off to Freeman as he'll go down to the 22. Now let's see the defense for Columbus. Let's see how they'll do. Okay, third down and eight. So at the own 22, let's see if they can convert here. Throwing on third Luck. Down. We'll heave it downfield and it's caught. He's got his man on the comebacker. And that'll be a first down. First pass of the day goes for a first down. So it's first down again. Now it's Luck going to throw it left side on the slant route to Ellington. It looks like they're trying to hurry up. Second and four, Luck to throw it right side complete. And he'll go down to the 46 as it's going to be first down. 14-yard pickup. Here's a replay. What do you think of this catch by Ellington right here? Um, caught it and he got the job done. I mean, it wasn't the most important catch, but it worked. Yeah. All right, first down for Chicago. Mel Fonwu credit for the tackle. First down for 46 of Columbus. Play action, luck. He's going to throw it. Left side, it's complete. And that's a huge gain for a first down. Jones with the reception on the play. Four for four. Let's see how it'll do. What do you think of that catch? Nice catch. Yeah, Andrew Luck teeing up to a four for four. He's really producing well for the Blues. Yeah. Another, another look at it. Gets it and gets a good game for his team. Just outside the red zone. Yeah, just outside the red zone at the 23. There it is, first down for Chicago. Luck steps back and throw right side complete. And did he get the first down? No, I don't think so. He's just short at the 15. The second and one. I thought he got the first down. What do you think? Um, no matter what, I don't think so. He was really good to what you're I doing. And I think that right there, he knew right away where the So second and one. Oh, that he jumped offside and Freeman free play. I'll get down to the inside the 10 and it if it's an offside, I, I think they're going to decline it. Decline the penalty. There you go. And Zettel's frustrated with himself. And first and goal at the nine. First and goal now at the nine yard line. And they won't get this play off before the end of the first. As it is, we still have no score yet. And, okay. So nothing, nothing at the end of one. Let's see. Back 
All right. So a reminder that week six will be midweek, which means it'll be Thursday at, excuse me, Tuesday and Wednesday. Times will be determined on Monday. So first and goal, Freeman gonna run it, spins around, gets down to the five. As, let's look at the noble inactives for the aviators. That's weird. No one. Why would they show up there's nobody on the injury report? Looks like... Eli's off the air right now. Locke's gonna run it! Oh, it takes a big hit down the one! So, the third down and goal at the one. Third and goal. Let's see if they can get it. Let's see if they can punch it in. Luck steps back, bringing pressure as Columbus and throwing it away. And it'll be fourth down. Let's see if they'll go for the field goal. Fourth and goal. Let's see. There. Here's the field goal attempt. This is a short one. It's 18 yards. Kick is up and good. 23 nothing is Chicago. Now let's see if they can get out of this funk and try to win. Let's see. They'll kick it off. We're seeing the back of the end zone and return it. We're going to take it to the 20, spot down to the 22 yard line. So, we'll start, so Columbus will start there, first down. Now this offense about ready to Let's see. They last time they the offense for Columbus is coming back on the field. And let's see. Waffelsberger steps back. He's going to throw it deep. And it is incomplete. Almost caught it with one hand. Man. That would have been, that would have been a world-class catch for Sammy Watkins. Hey, Eli, you there? Okay. Okay, so while you were away... Chicago scored a field goal and Sammy Watkins almost made a world-class catch But he didn't complete it. It's second down Wafflesberger a throw and it's oh and DeAndre Hopkins had a chance to receive it And it'll be third down Look at this, Waffelsberger, how did he drop that? You gotta hang on to those when it comes. Yeah. So it'll be third down and ten. At the, at the own 22 yard line, Roethlisberger steps back, they will throw, right side complete, but just short of the first down line. And I'll be right back, and I'm gonna leave a camera angle for for Eli to watch the game while I go. How how's this? Is this good? Um, it's a little zoomed in, but it'll. All right, I gotta leave it somewhere. So how about this? I don't think that's good. That's good, that's good. This, I can't, I can't leave it like this. Let me get something to hold it up. Alright. Alright. Yeah, I'll do this thing with no commentary. I'll be right back. Or, 
you can see from there. After chip shot field goal, maybe the I just got to go real quick. It's a balancing act, isn't it? Because you're exactly right. They're none too pleased that they didn't punch it in for six points. But they also have to remember they did put points on yeah, the board. Three and, points is three points. And in this league, <laughs> you take points when you can get them. Not easily done. Across the 30 to the 31 yard line. A um, gain of three well, second it is down. not any good camera. Well, he hasn't made much of an impact so. in the running game thus far, and after that last run, not um, much is going to change in that area. He hasn't been able to get anything going, and really the offensive line not helping it. him much. <laughs> On second down, here's Love. Looking left side, and he's got a man. That's okay. Freeman. And he'll get it up near the 35, right at the 34 here. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that, game. folks. And I do apologize for that. So, Devontae Freeman is what I can see had a catch. Alright. Looks like I have 31% on my phone. It'll alert me when it's at 20. Okay, third and five for Chicago. At their own 34 yard line. Luck takes the snap. Pressure coming and Geeks, he gets sacked. Brown with the sack. I think he took too long. Look at this. The line was doing his job. Look at that. Line was doing his job, but it was his fault. He should have been more mobile in that situation. I agree completely. Okay. So it's fourth and sixteen as they'll punt it away. And uh, they'll bring it down to the twenty-six. And so a fifty-three yard punt will get to first down and ten. Alright, so all right. that one is the, is off the air. So we'll have, we'll have it first and 10 for Columbus at the 26-yard line. Big Ben takes the snap, going to hand it off to Barkley. Oh, why did he stop to do that? He had a hole. He could have gotten a first down. And so he reached the two-minute warning as it's 3 nothing Chicago at the two-minute warning. And we'll be back. Looks like on the camera, Atlas come back on the air. And my phone's at 20%. I'm going to plug it back in. For some reason, my phone. All right. So it's second and two now for Columbus at their own 34 yard line. Roethlisberger. Now throw complete right side to Hopkins. They'll go down to the 43-yard line. And it looks like they're going to hurry it up. He's got his first catch here before halftime, and it goes for a first down. Roethlisberger. And throw it right side to Hopkins, and it's caught. Second and five. Two, that was Watkins. Sorry. Second and five, Roethlisberger. Throwing it up in the air. And it's picked up. Oh, no. They got to go to booth review. You think this was a pick? I'm not sure. It was hard to tell. I don't think so. Look at this replay. Catch. I don't know. I don't know if he got his second foot down. Eddie Jackson looked at it. And well, that was, they, they sliced off the feet. They might go to booth review. Let's see. No, they're not going to go to review. I don't, I don't think that's a pick. First down. Luck throwing it right side and it is dropped. That, that was a, that was a good play by Melvin on that play. So it's second down. So let's see the replay, Matt. Look at luck. You think he should have fought that in? 
Yeah, I agree. Yeah. I think I think it was more of a drop than a pass deflection. Yeah, I agree. Second down and ten for Chicago at their own twenty-four yard line. Ellington is in motion. Snap directly to Luck. Gonna throw it, dump it, almost intercepted. So it's gonna be third down. But what do they say all the time? If he had really good hands, he'd be playing offense. The offense on third down. Third down and ten for Chicago at their own 24-yard line. We'll see if they can convert here. Handing it off to Freeman, and he'll go down. And a timeout's called by Columbus. And so, with I think 121, they showed on the clock. So we'll go to break. So fourth and fourteen. And now following that time they're gonna punt it. Back out onto the field. Punts so this one away. As he'll punt it away for the second time. This and is he'll get dropped down so to the twenty-eight. Will be first down from there. Hands first and ten. Let's take a look at Big Ben to today. Ben Four for seven, twenty-three yards in an interception. He's, he's got to do a better in this game. What do you think? Yeah, I think he is a little bit worse. Well. Looks like it might bring pressure. Roethlisberger has that. No, no, no time. Here's he throws. So do left side, and it's caught. He steps out of bounds at the 32 second down. But it appears that they read man defense and went to the out route. And what you have to do on that one is the receiver's got to make sure he works in defender. Second and six. Let's see what they do. I think they. Who knows? They might bring. I think they might bring pressure. No, I was totally wrong on that. And they're gonna throw it out left side to Hopkins, and it's caught. And a timeout by Columbus. First down for 43. After the timeout with a minute on the clock. Roethlisberger throwing it. And he's open and complete to Nelson. I think that might be Jordy Nelson. Oh, Kelsey, excuse me. Man, that's Travis Kelsey with the reception. His brother, Jason Kelsey, also plays in the in this relocation league for the Orlando Wizards. So... He knows what the uh, now it's first down. Baker with the tackle. He had a phenomenal game last week in Dublin. Despite not getting the win, he forced some turnovers. As he'll throw left side to Hopkins and it's caught with the clock running. 30 seconds to go. Six yard gain on the play. And it's second down. Let's see. Catch by Hopkins. He does a good job getting in and turning. Let's catch right here. Turns. Second and four for Columbus at the at the 30 yard line of Chicago. Roethlisberger throwing it on the middle, and it's caught for the first down by Jason Travis Kelsey. Excuse me. And Columbus calls their last timeout with about 20 to go. Oh, I was totally wrong. Three seconds. I'm sorry. And so they're going to go for the tie on the field goal. From the left hash, this will be a 41 yarder. 41 yard attempt, kick is up, and he got it. And so we are tied at the half. So, so let's recap the first half. So, what do you think, what did you think of the first half? There weren't really any major plays or anything. Yeah, there weren't any major plays, but From there, let's, head off and check out let's see. And they were well, I like the best. The I don't know. Julio Jones, a 
touchdown catch uh, in the victory. Lastly, let's head up. I saw the best of checking on the Vikings at home in but Minneapolis. Every team looked to do good. Detroit Lions. Nick Foles catching uh, passes as his guys remain unbeaten. Meanwhile, in our game, it's been as tight let's as see. we expected. All tied. Andrew Luck. Uh, throw. That key play was the uh, play to Jones from Luck. That was the key play in the game to get Chicago up as we are getting ready for second half kickoff. And it's going to go on the back of the end zone. Touchback. Here's Andrew Luck coming back out. And what do you think? You think they can get something going here? With the game Maybe. this close, you've got to feel there's a sense of urgency for them going on offense. Starting right it off strong, they have to start. Handing off to Freeman, and he'll go down to the 27-yard line. And it'll be second down. Let me check my battery. It's at 41 percent. I guess I can play it on plug. Okay, second down and eight. Lock gonna hand it off to Freeman, and he'll get past. He'll get a big run on the play to the 39. It'll be first down. What do you think of that 12-yard run by Freeman? That's a nice run. That's an impact play right there. I think he's the captain of the team. So, first and ten at their own 39 yard line. Luck going to take the snap and handing it off. This time he goes nowhere, loses one on the play, second down. Looks like they knew what they were doing. On well, the next play, I would do a passing play. What do you think? Oh, uh, I agree. But I've been in so many games where it doesn't work running the ball. It doesn't work running the ball. I think it was also blocking 78 on Chicago. I think it's the right tackle. He got. He was the one that let that go and let him spin around. So second down, Luck steps back to bring pressure. Going to throw right side, complete to. Man, who's that? Hollins, Hollins with the catch. And so first down. So, gets catch and run there. We go down. To about the... It goes down right there. And it is now first down for Chicago at the 46 yard line. Luck taking the snap. He's going to throw complete to Henry. And it'll go down to 37. It'll be second down. But, so, Hunter Henry with the catch. Let's see this again. What do you think about that catch by him? It's a pretty good catch. And he gets back up there. Coach is happy about that. Facing a second and two after so, second and two. It was Colbert on the tackle. The second down and two. Luck. Play action. Actually, yeah, it was more of a bootleg. So, third down. Throws an incompletion. Let's see what they can do. They gotta get the first down if they want to go for a field goal. This is way too far back. The offense on third down tonight. They've only converted once in four tries. So 25 percent. Let's see if they can convert here. Hanging off to Freeman. He's got a hole. Picked up by Columbus at the 35. What a huge turn of events. Wait. Let's see the replay here. And I don't know. We got to see a closer look. 
rooms and hearing the scouting report from my coaches. And if someone had a particular problem carrying the I don't know if they're going to go for a booth now review or not. Hey, make sure you give a little extra attention. Most turn all turnovers are reviewed. He's dropped it the last couple of games. Let's see if they want to take a closer look. So no. Field position for so both teams have a turnover in the game. First down. Roethlisberger well, throwing complete to Kelsey at the 48 and a first down. Third reception. Kelsey's been an intriguing part of this Columbus offense. I agree. Somebody that wasn't really expecting to do I mean, like, be a star player. Really well, Kelsey's usually a star player. Back when he's usually with Kansas City. He's. He's been, he's been, he produced for Oklahoma, uh, Chicago, Columbus, Columbus, he produced for Columbus. Oh, what kind of formation is this? What kind of formation is it? Got to hand it off to Barkley, that ends up working good. Uh, Still gets down to the 38. I did not expect that. That was a confusing formation. Look at this. Barkley ends up getting a, a nice run. And he'll go get a first down. Also, this is completely unrelated to the game. I think I got my karma for picking up Joe Mixon. No, he got hurt. He's out two to four weeks. That's my karma. As Barkley will go for a loss on the play. How many yards? Loss of four. So he lost four on the play. It's second down. They got to pass on the play or do a play action here. Steps forward. Roethlisberger. Got to heave it. End zone. And it is incomplete. He stepped out. That would have been an amazing play. So it's third down. I'll go for a play action here. Yeah, play action. Roethlisberger. Stops forward, pressure, and loses the football. But Barkley picks it up, and it'll go down to their own 48-yard line. And he'll go down to the 48. That's a loss of. That's a loss at 10. What do you think of that? Wait. That's a big loss. Wait, watch this. Yeah, he, he was down. He wasn't down. I mean, I meant. So Wing will punt it, skied in the air, back in the end zone, and it's a touchback. Let's see, Devontae Freeman. Ten rushes for 26 yards and a fumble. So let's see, he, got, he has to... He popped a big one, but production-wise, he's not doing too good. 2.6 yards a game per game. Or yards per carry, I should say. So, first down and 10. Play action. Luck. Flag on the play. This could be a hold. Luck is going to get sacked. Yeah, I'm sure this is a holding. Let's see. It would be good either way, but I would decline it to get the second down. Yeah. That's good. So, loss of 10. Lost it down because they declined it. Luck. Steps back. He's going to throw right side to Freeman. He spins around. He'll get to the 15 yard line as we reach the end of the third quarter. T still a tight game here at the end of three. We thought we saw some big runs, but it's not, it's not turning out too good for them. 
What do you think? No, I, I don't think they're. It's been a tight, low scoring spot. affair thus far. 3 3 yeah. is our score heading into the fourth. Let's see if they can score here. I doubt they. I don't know if they can. It's third, third and long. If they can convert it, that would be good. Luck steps forward. And will get taken down from behind by Derek Barnett. It's fourth down. Look at this. Barnett's on the left side. Breaks through. He had all day to throw. He could have. He could have run right there. Look at that. Do you see that? Look at that hole. Yeah. You can't. You can't see that hole from there. From that angle. But it's fourth down as Wing will punt it away. Received inside the 30. And he'll go down to the 35. That's that could be a that should be a six yard gain on the play. Now here's the Columbus offense. They're trying to. Oh, it's true. Columbus hasn't made a trip to the red zone. We're in the fourth quarter now. The first down for Columbus. Roethlisberger to hand it off. Barkley trying to get away. He'll get down to the 37 and second down. Okay, so it's second down and eight for the Aviators. Roethlisberger throwing it middle to... Moncrief and they'll get down to the 41 for the for third down Let's see Let's see the replay of this throwing to Moncrief. That's a good short pass Let's see We got yardage on the play. That's good So third down and three for Columbus at the 41. Walfelsberg steps back in the throw, left side complete. Here he goes down at the 48 yard line. And it's a first down. Sprinkle gets his first reception and first target. So let's see, look at that. I think, I think if he can produce in this game, they they got to throw it down more. If he produces, he could be good. So it's first down and 10 for Chicago, Columbus, excuse me. Play action, Roethlisberger. Pressure comes. He goes down. That's a loss of 12 on the play. That's a major It's been a defensive battle. Yeah, Let's see. Hits him down on the ground right there. He should have stepped that far back. Let's see if they can convert it. They need, they need 22 yards to get to the to get a first down. So play action. Pressure to get. It goes down again, and he's hurt. Roethlisberger's hurt. Oh no. Devastating sign. It's third at 35. And this is something you don't want to see if you're a Columbus fan. Big Ben's going to the locker room. That will effectively end his day. A turning point. Big play now the backup long. quarterback, who is it? And here comes throw number one for the backup QB. To the right side, it's oh. oh, EJ Manuel. This EJ Manuel is the backup. And Columbus will punt. It's a fair catch called at the 14. Will be first down. 
possession here on the so let's see if they can score here getting ready to go as they take the field so let's see if Freeman can produce more this could be a this could be better for the Blues offense if Freeman can perform good better Locke had it off and he won't get a is that good what's it defensively a key was stopping the run game how they done it so successfully to me excuse me one second really did a nice job of paying attention during the scouting report meeting and you know Brandon when they do hit behind the line he lost the football it's loose it's going the other way oh my god Columbus just picked it up I'm sorry I missed that for you so we're at the two minute warning Columbus first and go up by five what do you think of that play? That was a good play. So it's our visitors with the football as we so get you reset. They They've got it first and goal, looking to take the lead here uh, in the late going. A I had to sneeze, but it's the damnest thing. It went away. First and goal. So first and goal at the five. Manual to hand it off to Barkley, and he'll go down to the two. So it looks like they might, they're not going to go hurry up, they're just going to run the clock smoothly. Manuel's had it off. He scores! He scores! St. Quad Barkley! And the Aviators take the lead in the final two minutes. What do you think? But I'm looking at the clock and I'm thinking, there's a long way to go in this one. Pick it up, Ideally, they would have liked to milk yeah. a little bit more time off now on the other side. That turnover was costly by Chicago. This is what we practiced the two-minute drill for. Let's see. Right? Yeah, you hope you've been in that situation before, and if you haven't, you just have Kick to is up and good. Get this thing done, but boy. And it's 10 to 3. Two minute drill now. Let's see if they can see if they can convert here. He'll take it to the 5. And he'll take it up to the 26. That's where they'll start. They need to score a touchdown. And they got to get 74 yards to get there. You think they can get there? First down and 10 for Chicago. Luck throwing it. Complete toward the middle and called in by Ellington. It's second down. They're going to hurry up offense. Hurry up offense to the 35, for second and one. Luck throwing left side complete. Step out of bounds. Oh, I don't know why he didn't step out. I want to stop the clock. First down as he doesn't get out of bounds. Luck throwing it left side. It's complete. Looks like someone joined the party. And, and yes, you're on the air. Go ahead. Eli, who's on the air? That was oh. one of my friends. Alright. So, first... Our party is now private. So, first and ten for Chicago. Luck. Back to throw. Yeah, throw. Complete! He's in the red zone! Pushing his way down to the 13-yard line. They'll hurry up. And when do you want to? When, when, when would you use your timeouts? Luck. Luck's going to run. And he is down at the one. First and goal at the goal line. Luck steps back. Rolling left side. Throwing. Short back. Almost intercepted. And it's second down. They need this to try to to try to tie it up. 
Let's take a look, look at this. They could have intercepted right there. I mean, that was good pass deflection by Zettel. I think Zettel's 91 on the defense. So second and goal. So looks like they might pass here. Luck. Has time. Well around Luck. You got the right side. Freeman get in. And he's down at the two. Timeout. Timeout Chicago. Oh my god. You don't have time. You got to call your timeouts now. Go on. Oh, that would have been a great catch. And it's fourth and goal. Two seconds left in regulation. This is it. This is the play right here. What do you think about this play? But this replay, that would have been an epic catch by Freeman. This is it. This is it. Fourth and goal at the two. Luck. Edge on incomplete, and Columbus is going to hold on and win. So, what a game. What a game. What do you think of that? So, we'll give you the standings update. So, Chicago drops down to two and three. That drops them down to 13th of the, game of, old. of the standings. So for Columbus, they move a step closer yep. to 500 as their record improves so, to 2-3. And, and, and I'll put a check on them. Meanwhile, for the and Columbus here, will they drop Columbus will actually go up to 13 with, with the, the win. And, and Chicago will drop down to, to 14. Columbus 49ers. 2 and 3. Gets a check mark. So, that saves right Columbus. Oklahoma oh, City is, is now the next team to try to save it themselves. Okay. So, on the air. Alright. Eli, you ready to sign off? Yep. Ready. Okay, thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, leave a like, share, subscribe. To my channel really helps me out a lot and let's let's throw in now if you want to see Eli Atwood in another video let's leave five likes if you want to see him again so so I told you the standings and so fo follow me on Twitter link in the description below for injury updates Anyway, I'll see you later. Goodbye.